where you knot it last is going to be where everything is going to be sitting at very skinny on the on the on the on the end and then very kind of like it gets thicker you see the budding um you see the end this is what came out of one kind when i was combing out the hair it's crazy because Challenge accepted. Here's your bacon. Welcome back to another video of Activers Universe today. It's a new day. Let's go. And we got a lot, guys. Mike, yeah, I hear ya, I hear ya. We got a Banger, 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 let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, 24 months, 25, 26, 27, 26. Hey, so this is 26 guys so for those that don't know activers jewelry just dropped activers.com you'll be able to find activers cross activers jewelries activers accessories and activers mask so that mask that you saw me wearing earlier that is a mask from activeverse.com so make sure you go check it out and share this play before we get into the video but guys we've been on this journey for 26 months now and it's fabulous it's amazing to see a lot of people that has grown their dress with me i've seen so many updates so many people that sent me their uh you know dreadlocks and stuff like that and i've done like a whole life review uh if you guys haven't checked that out maybe you ended up in there so check it out i did a live review of dreadlocks subscriber dreads and also i picked top 10 of my best subscriber dreadlocks and i'll put it up there uh from you know anybody that has been subscribed to me from the beginning and the start appreciate you guys for showing some crazy love for the last video i said i was going to give somebody a free oil for their hair a code for it for js locks merch and the winner of that giveaway is slice Line, my dude, I always see your comments saying Activers Universe, uh, create your universe, let's go. All the models that we got going on on this channel, I've been seeing you, you saying it. So hit me up on Instagram telling me that you are the guy, the slice line. Guys, man, it's been 20, oh my god, 26 months. It's just crazy, man, from the beginning till now, the progress that we have had with my dreadlocks. I've been through so many things. I've been through hell and back, and I'm here. There's a lot of things happening on my dreads that are coming up in the future. So I'm gonna break those down in the upcoming but before we get into the video here is intro Intro Having to grow dreadlocks for this long is 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 it's not that hard right it's two years is not too bad but the length that I have my my length goes the back of my hair goes all the way down here the front probably goes I'll show you because I'm gonna take it down in a bit all I'm telling you guys is that I've had a tremendous growth you guys have not checked out my previous videos to learn how to grow your hair to grow to learn how to maintain your dreadlocks or whatever go check those out because it's not nothing really magical about it it's very simple how to grow your hair how to get locked how to do everything like that I think what people really struggle with their hair is the going through the ugly stage especially uh, starting off right like a lot of people start off and then they just fade off like during the ugly stage today they, they give up uh, and the ugly stage some people don't call it that ugly stage because it's just not ugly to them it's just natural look to it i will say there is an ugly stage because there's times that people go through that rough time and give up if it wasn't ugly they wouldn't really give up you know what i mean but i'll tell you this if you persevere and really pass through that stage you will literally appreciate the amount of length that you the amount of journey that you have traveled and it really end up liking your dreadlocks and also being an inspiration to others because a lot of people will end up following you on instagram youtube whatever it is to see your journey and also how much you have came up. A lot of people knowing me since before even I had my channel, they see me in Gunther the Great's channel and they're like, bro, your dreads, like it's crazy how long it's been. And I understand that because I went through it. I went through the ugly stage. My ugly stage was really growing my hair and you know maintaining it and all that stuff before I got my locks, but I didn't have a 
ugly stage through my lock stage because I persevered. I perse I perse persevered. I persevered before I had my locks. And through my journey, I was able to connect to so many of you guys from the internet. And it's amazing to me how we just went from nothing to 20,000 subscribers. 20,000 people. More than 20,000 people have seen my, you know, my channel. But 20,000 people said, I'm going to click this subscription button. That's just... I'm just grateful for y'all and that's why I'm gonna start doing even more giveaway from now on from I'm, I'm gonna do a, a weekly or a monthly giveaway so for this giveaway it's gonna be the oil but for next giveaway it's gonna be my drill lock accessory you guys know that I just dropped throughout the stage it's crazy like this stage brought me to where I'm at to where I have drill lock jewelries like it's crazy I'm I'm selling drill lock jewelry so now I'm giving it away I'm gonna be able to for you guys to have this and really really like really really accessorize your hair or your dreadlock and make it the best the way it looks it should be looking with the accessories of course people just gonna automatically compliment you like how dope your hair is because it just pops out like like if you look at me right now what pops out is my accessory this thing right here it speaks to you it speaks to you more than it, it should but it does it's, this is a silver piece that I have on the website it's called the silver piece and what it represents is not just from the natural perspective but from the spiritual perspective because active versus a whole spiritual side of things right so you got the active verse cross which represents that act in the word of god the verse the verse act the verse and create your universe act the verse and create your own universe and then we have the saints cross which is the cross that you carry this is the burden that you carry when you are following christ and making sure that you are different than anybody else being the best person that you should be and you could be and we have the peace which is you know peace that you make between each other you know the bible one of the things the bible says is be a peace with everybody seek peace with everybody seek peace because whenever there is peace there is it won't be chaos you know what I'm saying that's what it represents so when people look at this they're not just looking at they're not just looking at the jewelry they're looking at what it signifies and that's what it does so uh I'm gonna be giving away a free free of your choice of if you want you may even mix and match it if you want so you can get like three of each or you can get six of one of each six of one uh, which is you know I have a six piece of uh activist a six piece of saint and six pieces of silver piece and to be a winner all you have to do is really subscribe and comment that like and then comment down below a banger comment it may be uh something that can help somebody out it could be uh the model it could be you know you may be saying it and, if, and it's usually the people that i keep seeing again and again commenting on previous comments so if you haven't commented on other videos just go back and comment a few ones because they'll just literally pop up and notify me if you have commented on these videos and so that's all i part of you i'm gonna be giving that away because i love you guys i'm thankful for y'all 20,000 subscribers that's just crazy wish i can give it to everybody but what i wish i can do for everybody i can do it to one of you so it can be you just comment down subscribe and like that's all you have to do going back to my hair i'm gonna be taking it out right now to show you what's going on with it there's one thing i'm still struggling with my hair and that is still dandruff and this crazy thing is now that i've learned what it is that i have not done correctly i think on my next set of locks i will be correcting everything that needs to be corrected i love these locks and uh probably the best hairstyle that i've ever had in my life not saying that it's gonna be gone anytime soon guys but you know expect for new things to come you know like one cannot live in the same place for the rest of their lives one has to change to become one's better version but guys i'm actually dying my dreadlocks i've decided on the color uh based on your guys's preference uh i have not taken the majority vote but i've taken i think the second vote that there was uh the reason was because i wanted to really do that and um i wanted to see what it would come out and also to promote a new channel that's coming up uh this new channel also that i wanted to tell you guys about i haven't mentioned to anybody yet i've been you know contemplating on it but it's just gonna be a one thing and it's about uh activist has been incorporated on this channel right here and i wanted to change it up a little bit i wanted to make it for the dreadlock fam it's gonna carry you know this is gonna carry out from activeverse to a different name so be ready for these updates there's a lot of things coming up like i said i'm dying my hair too a lot of things that i've been working on to make sure that i'm reaching out to the amount and cap capacity that i'm able to with my editing video skills and uh and telling story with you guys supporting me i was able to achieve and acquire this amount of subscribers and uh how much more can we like can we get to you know what i'm saying i think 
this is just the beginning it's been two years but yet i feel like sometimes i do feel like it's been a slow growth but sometimes i feel like it's been a fast growth don't get me wrong guys i'm i'm i'm, I'm so grateful for it i'm just i'm just not thinking about utilizing this as a main source of income in a way or at least getting there right so i want to be able to expand and treat it as a business as it should be also and not just for pleasure which i have you know the pleasure of communicating with you guys even doing business uh that's why i launched you know the jewelry and the stuff so i can you know get some support uh to really see that like i could do i can do this and not have to worry about any other jobs or any other things on the side that i have to do and you know that's why that's why having a supporter is the best thing in the world like from youtube you guys already understand that people make money off of youtube that money either is going to help me you know clear my day so i don't have to do another job and focus on you know getting you guys the best content or i can just struggle with you know few thousand subscribers and you know few hundreds of views and not be able to do what i love to do and fail at it so the best way to treat this is as a business because if i'm not treating as a business i will never get that support with that being said there's going to be a change on this channel and also there's going to be a new channel so keep your head up for that my hair is going to be new color soon and i know that's a great news for you guys because you want to see new things and new hair colors and stuff like that and i'm talking to you guys heart to heart right here because i don't usually do this i don't usually reveal the plan till i actually just do it and you know let you guys you know uh, figure it out but i feel like guys i owe you guys this now and from where i have came to or from where i came from to now i have um i've grown uh personally you know spiritually and as a business person also uh to understand that this is not i can't treat this like a pleasure only uh, which it was for that in the beginning but now it's, it's becoming a business so thank you guys for everybody that bought my dread my, that bought my dreadlock accessories i really would love sent everybody that bought it you know 25 percent discount next time you shop with me it's because you deserve it you know um and that to show you that I, it's really not about the money that's about the support that you guys show to me as it shows it whenever you're doing something to somebody right you can't really show somebody that you love them without action like love is an action it's not really like saying i love you or I appreciate you appreciation comes with something to it you know I appreciate you here is something and it doesn't even have to be money it could be love it could be like a subscription you know this is all the what you guys have done for me already and people that are new hope you guys you know find this channel as authentic as it should be uh and you know being open real open to you guys you know I'm not at a place where I can go full-time on this and that's what I'm trying to do and I'm also looking to uh, hire somebody to edit my videos uh but I've had challenges when I'm delegate to that because I where we stay at like i couldn't upgrade the wi-fi and you know everything is almost done electronically and sometimes when i upload something it takes days for it to go on youtube and that's why i haven't been consistent on the time that i usually set to upload which used to be tuesday thursdays and saturdays and now i'm just like sometimes the tuesdays i was able to get done because it's on one it's a one minute video just a tip for you guys and the wednesday the thursday videos and saturday videos is really an update or something that i've done to my hair but with the time giving with the upload time that i have on this with this internet it's just it just hasn't been a good thing and so i've been looking to outsource different places different uh companies uh, services to see if i can get on the side another wi-fi a better wi-fi because i can't upgrade the one i have uh, because it's connected to an apartment it's connected under a business over the apartment so the business literally owns the wi-fi and it does just like without them approving it you can't go but everybody been complaining recently about the wi-fi and they say they're gonna upgrade it our leases up in a few months and so this is all besides my dreadlock update guys i just wanted to share that with you guys so that you guys know my heart for those of you guys that listen from beginning to what i'm saying now you guys understand really where we headed and i'm glad you do because i'll be able to do a lot of things for you guys trust me in the near time soon i'll be able to do as much giveaway that i want to uh, without you know really hurting my business but showing you guys the appreciation that i have for you guys because i wish i could just give out send out to everybody you know this locks that have been subscribed to me at least to a thousand people but i want to get to a place where i can do it to a thousand people now i can do it for a few people maybe one two a month so i'm gonna do that but guys yeah my hair is where it's at like i said nothing big is coming to change in the near time soon in the future and maybe so just ho just hold on to your seat okay don't get mad at me uh because of thumbnails and stuff like that i'm trying to get you guys to this video so you guys can see and hear what i'm talking about and i'm, gl I'm glad you guys came but this is my hair it looks really good from the standpoint of like you know the contrast and stuff like that that you guys see but i'm gonna show you guys really the struggle that i'm having and i've been having and you know the scratch keeps itching the itch keeps scratching and it, i'm gonna show you guys just up close of what my inside of my hair looks like 
so as you guys see there's still dandruff issues that i'm struggling with a lot actually build up is it's just crazy because where you knot it last is going to be where everything is going to be sitting at and you know i try to clean my dread as much as i can and i got the ac viewers going on too but i know that the drastic change that's going to happen in the future will be the reason of this uh, the issues I'm struggling with and I'm dealing with till today I've you know I have not I, I always like talk about it but I've not fully like said like okay I'm done with it or anything like that and uh, you know I've tried to bring you guys as much banger that I can without really hurting my hair and dreads but as you guys seen on the previous video when I combed out one of the dreads you see the deadness of it because of the bleach and the dye that I've had to my head um, but yeah man this is what my dreads look like I have 50 something dreads 52 maybe now that I've had two congos that ended up or yeah two hairs that ended up combining together and so this is what my hair looked like guys i got the little eye taper that i usually do on the sides yeah my hairline is still here you know what i'm saying i have the baby hairs making my hairline i used to have a whole hair because if i trimmed it down and i'm beginning the front and then i just kept on lining it up kept on trimming 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 and then it kept on going up to where i grew it out and then combined it with the dreads so that was like the biggest accomplishment that i'm really proud of myself to do because that's that's, that's like a whole ugliness that i was going through right here for a whole six months before I connect it all together and pay it out, you know what I'm saying? It looks really good in the front now. And then I have a cut, you know, that goes all the way around. High top, uh, usually, you know, I like high top, really. I think my for a feature, maybe I may end up getting a mohawk dreads. I've always thought about that. That was like the thing that my dream in the beginning, which I have never accomplished. <laughs> Uh, so if I'm able, capable, then that's the future goal. Uh, this is the hair that I combed out in the last video. It looks like this. It looks weird. It looks so... It doesn't even look like my hair color. But you guys can see what I mean by, you know, the bleach. What it did to my hair. And, uh, you know, it, bleach can really affect your hair, man. You gotta know when you bleach your hair, you're, you're kind of risking it in a way for the future things that you want to do. If you want to comb out your dreads or anything like that, you just gotta know that, you know, the future, your future goal, basically. So you can see right here, some of the dreads are nice skinny on the, on the, on the, on the end, on the roots, and then very kind of like it gets thicker. You see the budding, um, you see the end that needs to be blunted. Uh, I, by, by no means my hair is uh, near to be in perfection, but you can see the old thickness of it and you just love it, you just appreciate it. And then you get to see the new thinness of it because of, you know, the retwist and, and the stuff that ends up happening at the, you know, the, at the back end of it versus whenever I got the dreads. It's just like, I didn't need to do any retwist for these ones. You just crochet needled it. Um, we just crochet needled it and it was done. This is what came out of one Congo when I was combing out the hair. Hair, it's crazy because it's just like the hair is, it doesn't look like it's like really damaged but it's fairly is damaged uh, seems to lack moisturization inside of it uh, versus like uh, you know like it's just like easy to break in a way like almost like you know a branch like I don't know this is what my hair is and uh how nappy it is i don't know if you guys can see it but with a bunch of dreads you guys can see that this is what my hair looked like regularly if i were to grow it out uh, from the roots up um but this is all combined together of a bunch of hair that came out from just a one dread but like you i can even turn this to a dread to be honest with you because uh, how much how much like i said i came out from it like i can twisting it and you know crochet hooking it and making it a, a one big old dread but yeah i just wanted to show you guys this this is the new update that happened recently i combed out a congo and combined it and made it a dread and yeah that's it guys i uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video you guys hopefully hopefully, hopefully it, wasn't, it wasn't too much man hopefully it's a good update a good compass to what is coming in the future thank you guys for watching this video check out the previous video make sure you go check out my activers merch and also activers.com jewelries appreciate you guys love y'all new things banger things bigger things coming